Before this video begins, I want to give a special shout out to Quickie for becoming our channel's first member and donating three times on several live streams. If you want to receive a shout out like this, make sure to join the channel's membership or donate three times during a live stream. Either one works. Thank you and enjoy the video. Hello viewers and welcome to People Playground. This is a video game in which you can play with people. So this is a game I think that's about a playground. I think these are all the different playgrounds. Ooh, we got lava. That looks a bit hot, if you know what I mean. We also got snow. That looks a bit cold, if you know what I mean. Let's try reactor A5. What's what's that? Um, this doesn't look like a very fun playground. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, oh I probably shouldn't have... Oh, God. I, guys, I think the reactor is kind of going... I don't think I was supposed to do that. Okie dokie, let's try that again. How about we go to slanted? That looks like, that looks like a fun little... Little playground. Oh look! Oh, it's like a slide. Like at the let's let's drop a guy on the slide. Let's see how much fun they. Oh, whoops! <laughs> Whoopsie doodles. <laughs> oh, ooh. He looks like he's having fun. Look at him. He's just he's just he's just slowly gliding down the slide. He appears to be still alive. That's good. You know, I think this should be a bit more fun. Let's let's add, let's add something that can make this more fun. So let's throw a cup. That should make things more fun. Actually, no, we gotta turn the car on. Ooh, I have an even better idea, hold on. Let's strap his leg here to the back of the car, and then turn it on. Let's see what happens. Oh, look at this, this looks like so much fun, I wish I was here. Oh, you can, you can hear the friction of him grinding against the, against the side of the thing. They've been going down for quite some time. I'm, oh, okay, we finally reached the, oh my goodness. Oh, 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 yeah. Who put these shipping containers out here? I didn't do that, why, why don't I do that? Yeah, he's slowly losing consciousness right now. Yeah, he, he he is passed on. I'm just gonna... Oh, my goodness. I had, think I just crushed the lower half of his body on accident. It's okay, it's okay. We, we, we can fix him. This thing right here is called the life gun, and it makes people alive. Watch. We shoot him enough, and now he is sentient again. Yeah, he seems to be doing all right. He is twitching a bit. Oh, yeah, he, he's losing a lot of blood. We're gonna have to deal with that. I have just the thing. It's a little tool called bandages. Bandages everywhere. On the eyes, on the face. Okay, he seems to be doing pretty well. Let's just revive him one last time. Now we just need to give him some legs. Luckily, I have just a trick for that. We got ourselves an android right here. So this guy's gonna be our prosthetic leg donator. Did I just say donator? This this guy right here is gonna be a prosthetic leg donor. We're gonna select the lower half of his body. We're gonna press. Um, 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 um. Now we just gotta do a little surgery. Let's just uh, detach the upper half of the body here. There we go. Why does this shipping container keep wanting to be in the shot? Get out of here. You're not part of the show. Shipping container's gone. Uh, our android seems to be alive and well. Our legs, uh, pair of legs seem to be doing... Oh, there's some blood on there. Let's clean that off. Wipe off all the blood. Make sure there's uh, no evidence. There we go. Cleans it off the floor, too. Yep, there we go. No more blood. Okay, we gotta make sure the legs are firm. Let's, uh, let's, 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 uh, let's, uh, do something about that. Bada bing, bada boom, we got standing legs. Now all we gotta do is attach our- Oh, our patient has died. Okay, our patient is conscious, yes. They're conscious, yep. Let's just stick them on there and attach a little... Attach a joint. Let's take off all the band-aids. Oh crap, I just deleted the body. Well, that means we're gonna need to put another person on these prosthetic legs here. Looks like we're just gonna have to do this the old fashioned way. Let's just, let's just, uh, you know, hacksaw his legs off here. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Attempt number two, let's try that again. We're just gonna forcibly attach the lower part of the body to the ground and tear the upper half off. Oh, oh, I don't like how juicy that was. Okay, here we go, this should be right. Oh, now the legs don't want a leg. God damn, just stand on your legs. I know what I did wrong. We gotta connect the blood source. Yeah, his blood's been falling out. It's kind of hard to stand up when your blood's falling out. Let's put a liquid conduit. This makes it so that the blood is flowing between the head and the legs. There we go. Oh, I think it's sucking his blood out. It's not very helpful, is it? Oh god, look what you did. Now it's just a dead guy on some fucking robot legs. What am I supposed to do with this? How am I supposed to prove to my boss that I'm a capable scientist? This android has seen so much stuff. He has been alive this entire time watching me do that. All right, let's just uh, get rid of subject number two here. Just toss this discarded subject off to the side. This is such an image right here. The robot's just sitting there wide-eyed. His face is covered in blood. Don't you say a word. 
or else this is gonna be going through you. Okay, so this is gonna be our new test subject. We're gonna test something out. How many grenades does it take to launch a human body? Let's put them about one unit away from the subject. Test number one. Okay. Sir, are you okay? He's still alive. I know what he needs. He needs some medicine. Let's just hook him up with the old medicine gun. That should fix him right up. I think the lower half of his body doesn't want to cooperate. Yeah, let's just rip the band-aid off right here. Let's just... Ugh. Oh, I think his whole head came off. You know, when you're working in the lab, sometimes accidents happen. You, it's just kind of a part of doing the job. Test number two. How many hits to the head can a human take with a bat before they fall unconscious? Let's see. Uh, trial number one. Bunk. Okay, that's one. Two. Oh, I think it went a bit too far that time. That was not supposed to happen. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I've just invented a new revolutionary medicine that can cure all humans of any disease. Not only can it cure people of disease, but it can also heal any kind of wound that you may be experiencing. This medicine is able to regenerate human flesh. It is the first of its kind. I think it's going to make a lot of money. But let's say, for example, someone shoots you with an SMG like this. See, this person is clearly writhing in pain because they've just been shot in the chest. Now, all we have to do is apply a dose of this medicine right here. Let's just... All right, here we go. Let's just insert... Yeah. Insert this into the subject and see what happens. Now, watch as their wounds suddenly disappear. What? What has happened? What? Oh. Oh. Oh, I think that, I think that was the wrong one. I meant to use this syringe. This is the life syringe, and it can heal any wound even as bad as this. Watch. Okay, you're alive. Let's see an acid syringe in the head, life syringe in the body. Let's see what happens to you if you simultaneously disintegrate and re-insintegrate. I think I just made up a word there. Let's see what happens. So this guy is simultaneously falling apart and being healed at the same time. What happens if we increase the dosage of acid by say two syringes? This is the power of my new life syringe. Even when you're being injected with acid, you can still survive. This guy's got more needles in him than me on a Tuesday. <laughs> oh my goodness, what? I just tried injecting with him with a syringe, and oh no, the life syringe. Wait, no, he needs it. He needs it, or else he's gonna die. No, no, don't, don't die on me. Don't die on me. Don't die on me. Don't worry, pal, I got you. Oh, that was clean. Did you guys see that? You now have a lifetime warranty um of this life syringe substance we're going to be surgically attaching it to your head so that it cannot be removed so you can pause time in the game you know time freeze and while time is frozen you're able to touch the 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 people watch okay i can pull his body apart rearrange it and turn him into a completely different kind of creature that is going to be his appendage now let's see what we made oh okay that did not last long now he's just kind of a whirling tornado of body parts right now what in the hell is this? This is not a human. It's also dead. We got three shots from a gun, and then boom, it's alive. Okay, final thing I actually want to uh, demonstrate is that when you pause the game and then spam this, it shoots so many bullets out. Let's see what happens. That was a... I liked that sound. This guy's head is no more. Let's test on an android. How many bullets can the android take? Not just this. Let's also take like an AK-47 and be like, yes, yes, yes. Let's take one of these machine gun things, fire a bunch of, bunch of, a bunch of giant pellets. Just spray them with bullets from absolutely everywhere. Let's see what happens when we unpause. That was loud. It's still alive, what the hell? That cannot be right, no, no. We just gotta fire a bunch of bullets from the most powerful gun directly into his head. Let's see, let's see, let's see you bulletproof this, pal. <laughs> oh my god, you went flying. This guy is no more, let's just, oh. Whoa, 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 he's Superman, what the hell? What is this thing? Oh. It's the purple gun mash that see what happens this is the detached 1200 meter cannon it is the barrel of a tank now what happens if we fire a hundred of those shots directly into a person let's see what happens well i think we got the general gist there Ooh, a lot of power behind that hello everyone my name is edward the android and welcome to my ted talk 
today uh, I'm going to be talking about my absolute unit. So uh, if you if you would uh, like to uh, divert your eyes towards my uh, massive unit right here, I'm going to test it out. <laughs> that explosion was oh my goodness the arm that explosion was a bit unnecessary it is raining body parts oh my god let's just, just line up oh my the head just fell out of the sky all right we got our group of people we got golden freddy in the corner right here all right let's test out the jesus christ why is it oh my god okay okay hold on we're gonna have to put this fire out that lagged the game Everything is on fire. There's just a pile of dead bodies over here. God damn, this thing is a menace. It's also great at cleaning stuff up. Like for example, if you have a flaming mess here, you can just, you can just, boom. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I feel like I'm Homelander right now. Okay, so this game has a lot of powerful weaponry like the fusion bomb right here. The fusion bomb is a high capacity nuclear explosive that does this. However, I've designed my own explosive. Feast your eyes upon the big ass rocket this may look like a collection of blue pixels but when you zoom out it's a firework let's compare the size of this firework to your average human being shall we this is the firework this is a person yeah you could break your leg from that kind of height let's tie this guy up to the uh to the missile and see what happens oh no oh you're 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 in for a big one here oh my goodness Imagine launching that thing on 4th of July. That's, that would be the most patriotic thing you could do. This right here is a missile gun, or as some people call it, an RPG. See, this is a guided rocket launch, which means whatever this laser points at, it will shoot. Watch. See, it does that. What happens if, if you... So one thing you can do with this is you can, you can, oh god, you can fire off a missile, like so, but then you can pause the game, right click on it, hit resize, and then just boom, make that thing really big. Whoa, that is a nuclear missile right there. Imagine someone just shoots, oh, it, I see it is crashed into a wall. So, uh, see that buddy? This thing is coming for you. Let's see this absolute unit take off. I, I don't think I, I think it's forgot where it's um Houston we have a bit of a problem here what happens if we intercept its path see what happens if we take a bus full of people and put it directly in the path of the missile that happens oh that had to hurt oh no oh that's not good worst of all someone inside the bus is still alive after that so what happens if you take like the guided rocket launcher and shoot it at something that's flying so let's, let's take the missile launcher, shoot at this guy, and then just throw him in the air. Oh crap, that wasn't supposed to happen. The missile chases him. Oh my goodness. Forgot about the battle bus over here. Looks like it's crashed into the missile launcher. Let's, let's uh, fire off. Let's just fire off all the missiles. No more, oh. One of the missiles targeted, the missiles are targeting other missiles. It's just so satisfying to watch missiles firing. That's why you need to enroll in the army today. So let's take this crowd of civilians right here. Let's take this grenade launcher, pose, like just prop it on top of this bus. Let's just uh, let's just fire some off in the air and see which ones hit. Doesn't matter. We're just having a chill day today. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This guy survived. This guy has the audacity. He has a mouth. This guy has a little mouth right there. He looks shocked. Part of his brain is exposed. This guy is alive and he's just sitting there making out with a dead person. That's disgusting. You deserve to be burned at the stake. Allow us to channel the power of the sun gods. Whoosh! Now they're all nice and on fire. Well, isn't that a nice vi uh, little visual to end the video off on? If you enjoyed this video and want to see more videos like this, make sure to like, subscribe, comment, and join the new channel membership so that you can support me and help me make more random videos like this. That's going to conclude it for today. Hope you have an awesome rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.